Hey, I'm Nick Taylor Vasey. I'm here with McLean's.ca at the federal budget lockup in Ottawa. And standing beside me is Usfer Ali Khan, who's the director of performance at the Institute for Fiscal Studies and Democracy at the University of Ottawa. Now, he's going to tell us a little bit about evidence based infrastructure spending and where it fits into budget 2017. So take it away. Thank you, Nick. So really, I think the, point, the key point that we want to make is that Budget 2017 has identified $21 billion of new spending in addition to the $186 billion identified in the fall economic update statement. So what we're really talking about is $207 billion of planned infrastructure spending over the next 12 years. But we can't forget that we've actually been investing in infrastructure for the last eight or nine years. $18 billion alone as part of Canada's act economic action plan and uh, to uh, provide stimulus measures for the global financial crisis. And I think the question is, is the evidence there in terms of understanding, well, what was the bang for the buck that Canadians received from this infrastructure spending? Did it meet Canada's future strategic infrastructure needs? Uh, what is the current state of our uh, of our infrastructure stock? I mean, the, is it uh, delivering really good performance for us? What is the capacity? So if we can really contextualize these planned infrastructure investments within the context of uh, a gap between needs and the current infrastructure stock, that's the evidence that we need to really understand that Canadians are getting bang for the buck from infrastructure spending.